Wait, guys, I might never post videos again. Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Mo, and as you can see, we're on our Town Hall 8, guys, and we're still moving up. How many walls do I have left? That's one of my biggest questions right now because I need to see how many walls I still have to upgrade. So 53, guys, so we're getting very, very close. That's 25, 26 million gold, uh, something along those lines. Uh, so we're getting fairly close. We're getting fairly close, guys, and we're pushing up. I'm super, super stoked. We are trying to get Dark Elixir still. Uh, we can't upgrade that, but we do need to research all of these guys. It's going to take forever. I'm definitely going to need to push up into Crystal uh, and areas where people are using uh, or where people have a lot more Dark Elixir, like start attacking some Town Hall 9s and things of that sort. Um, with all of my Elixirs, you can see I'm not collecting any of this stuff over here. I'm just letting people come and... Uh, come and get it, but <laughs> we are using P.E.K.K.A.s and Archers a whole bunch, guys. You can go, I can uh, show you guys this attack right here where uh, we absolutely annihilate. This is kind of a cool base for a Town Hall 7. I'll be honest with you guys. This is kind of a cool base for a Town Hall 7. Um, but we go ahead and we take out, we clear out these buildings down here uh, towards the bottom. And then we get a dragon up here. Uh, does he have a new animation again? I feel like it does. Uh... It does look a little bit different from the animation that they upgraded before, but we're going to go ahead and surround that dragon, guys. Take that dragon out completely with our archers, and we've still got 40 archers left, so we're going to go ahead and send the rest of them in down here at the bottom with these P.E.K.K.A.s. We're going to send in our level 10 king. It's crazy seeing our, our level 10 king on this base. I never thought that we would get there. I mean, I thought we would, but now that we're there, it's like, this is freaking awesome. I'm so excited about this because... At 10, he has his second level of his ability, and he just goes to town uh, on this base. We haven't used his ability or anything yet. He does start to go down in a little bit because he's being focused over the P.E.K.K.A.s, but that's okay. We're going to use his ability right there, and he's going to go raw and completely crush these guys. Absolutely wrecking them. We don't lose a single P.E.K.K.A. in this attack, guys. We don't lose a single P.E.K.K.A. You can see they're all running around. We've got four of them still up and rolling and then slowly they make their way over to these cannons i'm pretty sure we don't lose a single pekka we might lose that one are we gonna lose that one don't no don't die oh no <laughs> no one shot away one shot death that archer tower just freaking 360 no scope that pekka that was ridiculous all right but we've got another um set of peck arch guys with four pekkas and some archers and our king is up and rolling we've got our dark uh elixir drills doing work they're not doing too much but uh they're doing as much as they possibly can but we're gonna go ahead and raid and see what we can get we can actually upgrade a wall yay i still think it's so hilarious how people get excited about upgrading walls i mean i get excited about it but it's like so anticlimactic you know what i'm saying all right we're gonna attack this base with just our archers um <clears throat> and then i'm gonna train up so should we just, no, let's use everything. Let's wreck this guy. We're going to absolutely wreck this guy is what we're going to do. Because 175,000 gold isn't too bad, guys. And uh, we're just going to drop off our archers. And let's see, here's what we're going to do. All right, so we're going to try and keep our P.E.K.K.A.s alive for this entire attack. Okay, so we're going to drop our king in, have him take the brunt of uh, the damage. And, oh no. Okay, I thought that cannon was already focused on our P.E.K.K.A.s. But again, our goal is to try and get our um our pegas alive to keep them alive the whole time we're gonna drop that rage right there get our king up in here and we've still got all we want to do guys is in the raid with four pekkas that's our goal our goal is to end the raid with four pekkas alive if we don't do it then i'm never gonna post videos again okay <laughs> i'm kidding that would suck that would be absolutely miserable we're always gonna be posting videos i want to do this for a very long time so for those of you who've been here for a year and a half. Thank you so much for y'all's support. It's so amazing. We are definitely going to take this base out and keep all of our P.E.K.K.A.s alive. And our king is pretty much at full health, too. You can see we've already got all the loot because it was super easy. It was pretty much just a collector raid. And Mr. Oracle Darkness, who is not in a clan, uh, didn't know what was going to hit him. He probably hasn't logged on in about a month. And so that's why we were able to destroy him as we did. Where are our other P.E.K.K.A.s? Are there four of them right there? We didn't lose one, did we, guys? I don't think we lost one, but uh, 
We're gonna need to fast forward through that replay and make sure that we didn't. So here's what I've been doing with my army camps, guys, since I have, uh, or since I do have so much elixir. But actually, since I'm about to head out uh, for the day, I'm heading home to uh, South Carolina for the night. I'm gonna go ahead and train up two more Pekkas. And we're just gonna roll with 50 archers then instead of the 100 that we had before. <clears throat> Get all them up in there. One, two, three, and four. There we go. And I really wanna see, we guys, I might never post videos again. I might never post videos again. I'm kidding. They're definitely alive. One, two, three, four. All right, so we got to follow them the whole time. One, two, three, four. They're all still good. Did we lose one already? Oh, no, they're right on top of each other. What are you guys doing on top of each other? One, two, one, two. All right, we still got them. We still got them. We still got all four. Yeah, they're just right on top of each other. Of course we didn't lose any of them. Oh, or did we? One, two, three, four. Nope, they're there. They're all there. One of them was hiding behind the king. That was the biggest problem. Let's go back, upgrade a wall, guys. We are getting very, very close. And you know, why don't we check out our defense log and see how we've been doing on the D. Uh, so this guy came in with some golems, some hog riders, and a whole bunch of freaking wizards. Did he get my dark elixir? I swear, if this guy got my dark elixir, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to flip out. So there go his hog riders uh, heading up in there. The Teslas are doing a uh, good amount of damage to him. That Tesla just wrecked that hog rider. Those hogs just got owned. Uh, his golems are doing a good job of taking the focus. And we all know wizards do so much damage. But they, I feel like they take a long time to train up. This guy used so many of them that this army probably took forever. Uh, he definitely made his money back when it comes to... Oh, look at all those! <laughs> Get wrecked. He definitely made his money back when it comes to the elixir that he spent. But I think that we might actually protect our our Dark Elixir on this one, guys. Which is going to be epic. He does get 300,000 Elixir from what I remember. No, turn around, Wizard Tower. Oh, that Wizard Tower is about to get wrecked. Oh, no. Oh, yes, they're running around. Where are they going? No, stop focusing on the Golems. They're going to take my Dark Elixir. Oh, they're going to take it all. No. <laughs> Look at that waste of a rage spell. If our wizards had turned and focused on him, we would have saved 695,000. <laughs> 695 Dark Elixir, guys. But our wizard towers, I don't get that. Have you guys ever noticed, whenever I attack, a lot of times wizard towers will be focusing on a golem and they'll be like, oh, there's a pack of archers right there. Uh, and they just turn and go, boop, and then focus back again. I've never seen my defense do it, but that's okay. He's coming in here again. We just took him out. That's going to be it, guys. Um, so the defense is doing okay. Uh, I mean, as best as it can against uh, those kinds of attacks. Let's go visit this guy. Let's check him out. I bet he's a Town Hall 8 as well. Yeah, he's a Town Hall 8. Wow. Um, a very poor Town Hall 8, but that's okay, buddy. It's okay. I'm not mad at you. It's fine. But that's going to be it, guys. We are still maxing this out. I hope that you guys are excited about this. Uh, comment down below what you think I should push with. I know that uh, some of you already have. Some of y'all have said Go Wipe. Some of y'all have said All Dragon, uh, which would be crazy. Some of y'all have said uh, Garch, which is actually a good one. I really like Garch a lot. Um, but Peck Arch is working really, really good for me. And I feel like with this much elixir that I have and whatnot, that we'll be able to absolutely uh, annihilate some people. And once we throw our town hall in the middle and throw our elixir outside like this, oh, pop my neck, then we're going to absolutely crush it. But that's going to be it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Really do appreciate it. Make sure you all leave a like on the video for me. And as always, keep calm and clash on, all right? See you guys later. Peace.